Hello, chat. So, Rainbow High has clearanced out a bunch of their accessory packs, and my mom picked up a bunch of them while she was out. We have eight, five shoe packs, and three handbag packs, and I'm going to go ahead and get into unboxing these. Alright, Rainbow High Accessories handbag. Let's go ahead and do the handbags first. Boxes themselves are kind of. Okay, and here we have MGA Collector's Guide. Alright, so now let's see what we've got here. Oh, it comes with a little drawstring bag. This is really nice. And now the handbag itself. Okay, it's a drawstring bag inside of a basket. This is cool. I could absolutely see this being used. Handbag number two, let's go. Okay, presumably the same collector's guide. Whatever this is. Oh my! Rosie Redwood, I could really... Rosie Redwood, give me that! <laughs> okay. Now... Another one of these. And... It's exactly the same one. I'm guessing there was probably some code or some way of knowing what was inside, and that's why these were both left. But, um, I don't know, maybe if I could, like, get this fabric part out and, like, replace it with something else. But it's a neat bag. I'm not terribly upset with that. God, this is gonna end up being so much rubbish. <laughs> shadow High bag. Let's go. This is the only Shadow High pack here, which is a little disappointing. I really like Shadow High. Okay, there we go. It's not that hard once you figure the trick out. What's gonna be in here? Okay, this looks very different already. Once again, this drawstring bag. These are really cool and nice. Will this be the same collector's guide? It looks like this is the same collector's guide, so I'm guessing that it's like the same series in both. It's just branded different, but let's go! Okay! You know, I can vibe with this. I thought I still naked. Of course I'm still naked! What would you expect? <laughs> I love you. I love you. Would, would you not expect me to record doll videos while completely naked? Well, you're not completely naked, yeah, by the way. And flip-flops. Yeah, guess guess what, guys? Guess what? Commenters, guess what, chat? I am wearing flip-flops, underwear, and nothing else right now. I love you so much. I love you too, babe. I'm assuming that's not gonna stay in there. Oh, it is. Oh, boy. I love you. Say something for the camera. I don't want to anymore. Why? <laughs> Have I made it too intense? I love you. I love you. Shoes! Shits. Of me, feed me, never sleep on my, um, never sleep on the couch. I, I, I couldn't sleep on the couch, not this house. <laughs> uh, this was easier on the handbags. Okay. I'm gonna tease. I think this is exactly the same collector's guide in every pack. The shoes are definitely more exciting than the handbags. Really? I like that the shoes come in these, like, little boxes that look like shoes that you would get at the shoe store, and they even, like, have a thingy. Like, isn't this- Oh my god, that's cute. They're totally packaged like shoes, and they even come with a little drawstring bag. My third orange drawstring bag tonight, wonderful. I hope I like orange. Since I'm out here, <gasps> Whoa! I won't say the actual store. When I worked in the shoe department. I don't even think we had any fancy shoes that were wrapped up in tissue like that. Really? Yes, we got um, Poppy's butterfly boots. I really like that. 
I'm very excited for that one. They're very Halloween. Could absolutely put those on a Halloween character. The whole video was worth it just for that. Shows. Mm. Oh, this one has the little sticker dingy. I farted. I really like these little iridescent boxes. They're really cute. These are a lot smaller. Okay, a lavender drawstring bag. See, this makes me wonder, are they always going to be the color? Are they always going to be the color of the box? Okay, these are like some high heel slides. Magic! Another one. Oh, they have certificates of authenticity for a pair of doll shoes. That's hardcore, bruh. Eek. I don't know if I see myself keeping all of that. <clears throat> Dark violet drawstring bag. Mmm. Ooh, these are iridescent. I love that. Ooh, these are cute. Yeah, let's do the pink. Let's do the stink one next. The color stink. The color stink. Oh. Ooh, certif fart kit of authenticity. Rainbow High Mini. Very cute bag. The drawstring bags are really nice, honestly. Ooh, it's another one like... Okay, these are really cute. I like these a lot. They're another one of the, like, thigh-high boots. I really like the thigh-high boots. They're very cute. They're like... Yes. It's part of why I fell in love with Rosie Redwood here. One more. I saved my favorite color for last. I'm a red... Rosy Redwood. Let's see if this is anything you like. Boop. Yes! That's pretty! Ooh! It was worth the wait. These are definitely my favorites. And honestly, they would be a fun alternative shoes for Rosie Redwood. Just look at the carnage! So yeah, here is our haul. I think the highlights are definitely the uh, poppy boots and these red bad boys. I knew this video wasn't going to feel complete until I actually tried the shoes on some dolls. So I have Aurora the Absol, Rosie Redwood, and Torlai Stripe. Because Rainbow High shoes are compatible with G3 Monster High. I may have been a little off the uh, rubberized, vinyl-y, plastic Rainbow High shoes fit onto Monster High dolls, but these long fabric stretchy shoes don't seem to. wonder why on earth that would be. Maybe it's just harder to get them into place because it's harder to see what you're doing. I don't know. Okay, so I moved the red buckly shoes over to Torlai and... I gave Rosie these pink stretchy boots. They do fit with both her skin tone and the lining of her jacket, so I think it works reasonably well. And 
these purple magic flops for Miss Aurora. Yeah, I think that looks pretty nice. What do you say? Do these girlies look like besties?